Israel killed a number of senior Hamas military figures Wednesday 12 May and pounded three multi-story towers as it hammered the Gaza Strip with airstrikes. The towers raised to the ground by Israel housed Hamas facilities. Hamas militants in the territory also have been firing rocket on different parts of Israel, including Tel Aviv. However about 90% of these have been neutralized by the Israeli anti-missile Iron Dome. Thursday 13 May morning, a Hamas rocket hit a civilian neighborhood in Petah Tikva, causing injuries and significant damage. Thursday, Prime Minister Netanyahu said that Israel would continue to take action to strike at the military capabilities of Hamas and the other terrorist organizations operating in the Gaza Strip. Following three days of intense standoff between the Israelis and Palestinians beginning Monday, the U.S. President Joe Biden spoke to Israeli PM Benjamin Netanyahu and said that, Israel has a right to defend itself. This is the most severe outbreak of violence between Israel and the Gaza Strip since a 2014 war. At least 53 Palestinians and six Israelis had been killed in spiraling violence till Wednesday as Gaza-based militants started firing a barrage of rockets on Israel since Monday evening. The raging conflict between Israel and Hamas was sparked by escalation of clashes between Palestinians and Israeli police at a site in East Jerusalem, which is revered by both Muslims and Jews. The Muslims call it the Haram al-Sharif or the Noble Sanctuary, and foreign Jews, it is known as the Temple Mount.